The Lord's Prayer. These words, straight from the mouth of Jesus Christ, are the unchallenged laws and the happy beginnings of the student's stay at the Dilkusha Boys School in Nausori, Fiji. The word Dilkusha means happy heart. The property was established by the Methodist missionaries during Fiji's days of being a British colony, and the property contains a girls' school as well as a high school. Every day, after prayer and before classes, the boys at Dilkusha pick up trash and clean up the rooms. After that, the students are immersed in their lessons. The morning is obviously broken up by recess, and then it's just another hour before lunch. The afternoons at Dilkusha usually involve special projects and activities. Mrs. Pambu, she teaches just to come and teach the children on how the discipline of singing. I don't have any, any, any qualification background in singing, it's just that I love doing it and um, have tried to use this talent to widen the knowledge of singing with children instead of keeping it to ourselves. No top-rate boys' school is complete without a top-rate sports program. We don't have some bed. We always use a cutter. That's in Fiji. In Fiji, we use that. But we cheat. So we.
The Dilkusha boys team came in third place in a qualifying match for the regional cup. However, the real battle with the rival team, the Purple Vuthi Methodist School, occurred in the cheering sections. At the end of the day, the students are called to a pre-dismissal assembly for some gentle reminders on discipline. If you are going to be sick, then you continuously complain to the assembly that something is wrong with you. You need to find another school, probably. You tell the master, find him another school because he cannot listen to the teachers. Alright? Say good afternoon to your teachers. Fiji's treasures are not the gorgeous beaches. Fiji's treasures are not the illegal decrees of the unelected military dictator. Indeed, Fiji's treasures lie in the determination and faith of the students in compounds like Dilkusha. Fiji's truest gems lay in the unlimited potential of her youth. <laughs>